guys, Hamster Awesomeness here with Buttercup, my hamster. I got it like a month or two ago, give or take a few. Um, but she is a dwarf hamster, so I will show you her in just a minute. First of all, I'm going to show you the stuff that I have for her and how it is good or some different things that you could get besides what I have. Like, things that I'm ordering, or things that I want to get. First of all, here is a little igloo house. It, she just loves it. So, I'll show her, you her right now, actually. And, this is what she looks like. She is, she has red eyes, some people think it's freaky, but it actually looks kind of cute. She loves it. It is, she, she burrows out of the back. Dwarf says they burrow a lot. See, she puts her head out. But she sleeps in there. She either sleeps in there or behind her wheel. Which is kind of weird to me. But she does. Anyways. So that was the first thing. And this is the second thing. It's actually... It's just a toilet paper roll. She loves it. See, she loves tubes. So that's why I get fat for her. Okay, so basically, it can be a wheel. She could just go inside of it, and like she just did, she ran a little bit. And <laughs> See, she likes chewing on it and stuff. She's weird. Anyways, now there's that. Basically, just whenever you're done with toilet paper, you could get a, you could get a napkin roll. Anything that works. Here is Snack Shack. These are so good. My hamster loves it. See, she... That was full of hay, like stuff packed, and she ate all that. That was stuff packed too. There was not that little hole there or anything. She, she loves it. She's only had this for like a week, and it's kind of hard to chew. It's kind of hard, but it, they love it. It also files down their teeth. The whole thing's edible, even this. It's like, like a type of book that has like, I think. Either peanut butter or honey on it, but it's edible for hamsters. Please don't eat it, even though I'm saying it's edible. Please do not eat it. It's just for hamsters. <laughs> and I used to have a different cage for her, so I took this out of it because she loves tubes. So I just took this out of it and put it in there for her. Yeah, she could demonstrate how it works. You could just buy these off a line. You could buy a whole set of, like, a bunch of tubes. It's so cool. And they're not that expensive. So, see... She gets to go to this. Sometimes she sleeps right there. She pushes a bunch of bedding in there. She, she's crazy. Yeah, you can trap her like that. It's funny. But I probably wouldn't do that. It's not really that nice. But and this is just a rock. That's how they file their nails. They just walk across it and it files their nails. But I also use it. I put it under, under my water bottle and it keeps the water from leaking on the bedding. It's actually really good. You could use something like a jingle block, piece of wood, anything like that. But I like to use a rock. This is a silent spinner. It's only silent for like a week to a month. It's broken. This, it can't be too tight. But it has to be kind of loose. Um, but if she runs on it too much, it'll fall apart. And it could either fall on her or it could just be sitting there and she can't ride her full two or three miles at night. So I have to check it every time I put it back in there. This, I just go like this, I kind of push it down inside the bedding and I put the wheel on it so that the wheel does not go inside the, under the bedding. It's just, just made out of popsicle sticks. But so the we bedding is not going all the way up here and block her from being able to run. But, yeah, my friend gave me that idea. Um, actually she has a YouTube channel too, Hear Me Forever. And that's where I thought of making my YouTube channel for my hamster. This also, I made a tree out of this actually. It's just, you cut pieces of toilet, pieces of toilet paper roll, and you get this. You put, so get like three squares of toilet paper, put this in the center square, put some treats that she loves in there, and wrap it all around it and tuck it in. And it makes it awesome chew toy for them. She devoured it, so she just likes to crawl through this. She's crazy, but anyways, and I got these sort of little chew toys. She actually chews on them a lot. 
I am actually getting a little wood she toy barrel that she loves. My friend let her use it. Hers. And I just have this little food bowl. I get some like food in it. Like there's some corn, her regular food. So this is like a piece of food out of a snack shack that I got her. This is a baby food. It's actually really good. If you get some, you can also eat some. Anyways. <laughs> She also likes spaghetti, carrots. She loves lettuce every morning. That's a dried pea that comes inside of food. And this, it's not a hamster's favorite food, but my hamster likes it. My hammy forever. The, her hamster doesn't really like it. It's just a hay pellet, but yeah. So, guinea pigs love it, though. If you're getting a guinea pig, they love it. But anyways, there's my water bottle. It's blue with little polka dots on it. It has a little turtle up there, so I can show you whenever it's um, empty, so you need to put more water in it. So whenever you can't see the turtle, you put more water in. Um, anyways, this is her cage. I got her a bed cage, because she loves to run around, just in case her wheel breaks. So, see, she's right there. Um, over here, I've got her food in there. Some treats, treats and some more treats like oats and stuff i've got this tiny little ball for her but she doesn't need a big ball it's like the smallest ball they have but she doesn't need a big ball she's just a door hamster um the sand bath um every time before you give your hamster a sand bath you should always go like this just check through it make sure there's nothing gross in it because you don't want to give them a sand bath and not actually clean them. There's no point in that. And uh, here's some more of the little chew toys that she has. But those are just extras just in case the other ones like she devours and doesn't chew anymore. Just little decorated puff balls. Um, they actually shouldn't chew on these. It's not the best thing for them. I mean, it's not like they're going to die if they chew on them. But they probably shouldn't. There's just a little puff ball. But they shouldn't chew on things like that. So if you put it in there, like, watch it and then take it out whenever you're not going to watch. And any ball you have, I would tape it closed just just in case. Like, if you're not going to watch it, I would tape it just in case. So they don't get out on accident. Um, yeah, here, I'll show you my hamster again before I get done. Okay. Here's my hamster. Here's Buttercup. Um. And as you probably saw earlier, <laughs> uh, bedding is purple. But I'm getting her a new bedding. This is Care Fresh Complete. Or, um, yeah, Care Fresh Ultra, Ultra Care Fresh Complete. That's like the best bedding. I'm getting her new bedding. It's the same kind, but different color. And that will be my next video. But, um, since her wheel isn't really working. You know, look at her, she's in a wheel. Um, I'm creating her, I got her a new wheel. It's coming on Thursday. It's a flying saucer wheel. Um, those are, like, really cool. Yeah, I'll, wa I'll let you watch her eat a sunflower seed if she'll, uh, she wants one right now. Because it is so cute when she eats sunflower seed. So... See, just, this is basically what most girls put hair stuff in or makeup, but I put my hamster treats in there and hamster food, just because it's really cute. But anyways, here, if I can find her, there she is. Okay, there she is. Here's a sunflower seed. It's like so adorable whenever they eat it. See, she's eating it like crazy. She loves this thing. She just sits there. She'll just sit there if she has one. She has some plus eat lettuce. She'll just sit there and eat it. And if they're just chewing on the sh shell, it's okay. She does that too. She just chews on the shell after she eats the seed. Um, but she just does that for fun. Files out her teeth, so I let her. Um, so yeah, so don't be scared if they do that. But, yeah.
thank you for watching my video and please like and subscribe and give me ideas on different videos I should do so that I know what you guys want to see. Um, thank you.